I'm Jason UFC and today we have a story about UFC CEO Dana White eliminates UFC controversial country flag ban. UFC fighters are now allowed to include their country flags in their walkouts. Okay, let's get straight to the um, good part. Um, during the UFC fight night post fight press conference, UFC uh, CEO Dana White explained the decision to now allow fighters to represent their native countries with flags. Um, flags are back. I don't know if it's only their native countries, but I just want to say um, flags are back. Dana White declared, I was on vacation during the Mexican Independence Day and the no flag thing drove me crazy. So I was like, yeah, F that. We are bringing flags back. It drove me crazy. There's a lot of things that go on in a company this big. You can't micromanage everything. Something, sometimes things are done for the intentions of the right reasons or whatever. Everybody in this room know the way I feel about a lot of things. Basically, I don't give a F is the answer to most things. The no way continues. Everybody's too soft. Everybody's too sensitive about everything. When the decision was made to do this, I was um, just like, uh, what's the big deal if they don't have flag? Mexican independence, they flipped the switch and I was like, that's enough of the no flag things. Flags are back. If any flags hurt your feelings, too effing bad. Okay. I say, uh, wow, Dana White hasn't specified the reasoning behind the policy. It, it's it been speculated. It had to do with the invasion. Okay, so let's just get back to the point. Yeah, I mean, um, I'm an MMA casual, so I don't follow everything that um, goes on in the world of UFC and MMA. But I, be I believe the flag policy started around the invasion um, a few year, a couple of years ago, um, but I didn't, I didn't, I never understood what was the reason as to why they stopped allowing fighters to bring in um, their country flags. I don't know if it was the MMA media. I don't think the MMA media was like bashing the UFC. I don't think the regular media was bashing the UFC. I don't think the fans were saying like, hey. Um, you know, people shouldn't be allowed to wear flags. The UFC clearly has a lot of international fighters from Russia, from Ukraine. So I'm, I'm assuming, you know, this was a company decision, right? Like, I don't think this was a fans. It, it definitely, I don't think it was the media that, you know, said, hey, the UFC shouldn't allow um, fighters to bring in their country flags. But yeah, I don't, you know, I don't know who is going to be too sensitive about this. I really don't. Like I said, I don't think it's going to be the MMA fans. You know, obviously, like I said, the UFC has a lot of fighters, a lot of fighters from a certain reason, region, right, that will be carrying certain flags and, and things like that, you know. Um, but it's good to see, you know, you have um, fighters like Kobe Covington who run around with the American flag. Tito Ortiz used to come out with a, a Mexican and American flag. You know, there's other fighters from certain regions. They, you know, throw up their flag. That's a great thing. I, I don't see a problem with that. I am in uh, in favor of this policy and, you know, definitely being cool that MMA fighters are allowed to at least bring out their country flag or whatever flag they want to uh, bring out. But let me know your opinion of this story. Um, like I said, I'm an MMA casual, so I don't know the genesis of the reason as to why they stopped it, but we all kind of assumed it was the evasion a few years ago. Um, and now they're just like, you know what, let you know, whatever flag you want to fly, you can um, fly, you can fly that flag now of your country. But let me know your opinion of this story. Are you in favor of the flag, the flag uh, ban, or are you in favor of, you know, fighters? you know, going to the octagon, carrying their uh, country flag. I'm Jason, UFC. Today we had a story about UFC CEO Dana White eliminates UFC. We didn't say it's controversial. I don't know if it was controversial, but I guess the flag being banned was controversial. But Dana White eliminates UFC controversial country flag ban. UFC fighters 
are now allowed to include their country flag in their walkouts. How about that? Um, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the $1 donation button, and please tune in to the next video on this channel. Thanks a million for watching.